Hi and welcome to our YouTube channel Leo Production. If you love intense, passionate and something even dangerous romance, then you are in for a treat. Today we are counting down the 8 best obsession love stories ever in Turkish series with English subtitle. These Turkish drama explore the darker side of love where obsession blurred in the line between devotion and control. With thrilling plot lines and unforgettable characters, these series will keep you on the edge of your seat. In this video, we will dive you into the love stories that are gripping as they are emotional, showcasing the extremes people go to for love. Each series brings its own unique take on obsession love and with English subtitle you can fully immerse yourself in the drama. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated and more Turkish drama recommendations. Now let's explore the most captivating obsession love story in Turkish series. On number 8 guys we have Legacy. This Turkish drama series revolves around Sela Chorogdu play the role of Seher and Halil Ibrahim Sehan play the role of Yaman. Seher is a young and beautiful girl who lives together with her father. Her sister Kev Seher is not allowed to visit her parent after she got married to the hero Kremli family. Her father cuts all the ties with Kev Seher after then cannot forgive her. Yaman on the other hand is a handsome young man who does not trust women. He is Yusuf's uncle after his brother passes away. Yaman considers himself as a custodian of Yusuf. Legacy to Kishtomacy is about younger Seher and powerful men Yaman who come across with each other while taking care of their five year old Nifu. Will Se start to take care of five year old Nifu after her sister passes away? Who knows? Find out. On number 7 guys we have Marasli. This Turkish drama series revolves around Burak Denis who play the role of Jalal and Alina Buz play the role of Mahur. Jalal is a young man who was born in 1987 in the Meret, the city in the southeastern part of Turkey. Thus he is known as Marasli, a person from Meret. He has been working for a bookstore for two years and has a quite ordinary life. Mahur on the other hand is a successful photographer of ordinary lives who was born in Istanbul and went to Petrija school she come from wealthy family. The trusted AK Marasli to Kishtomasi is about a retired soldier who work as a bodyguard and try to find the real culprit responsible for an arm attack in the concert hall. Will Marasli manage to save Mahur? Who knows? Find out. On number 6 guys we have Aile. This Turkish drama series revolves around Aslan Soykan, who may be the head of his more nutritious crime family, but at the dinner table with his mother Julia, who ruled with an iron fist. He has to manage to keep the unruly clan together with a set of an unbreakable tradition. The foremost being is that you can't escape from the table. All that goes up in smoke and Aslan disturbs a family dinner for the sake of a woman he just met, the beautiful and young psychologist Devine. Devine and Aslan fall in love as they become closer. The psychologist cannot help but diagnose a discordant family, but can she deal with the narcissist like Asna without fully recovering from her own wound? Who knows? Find out. On number 5 guys, we have The Promise. This took a drama series revolves around Goldberg the mystery who played the role of Emir and Ozgi Yagis played the role of Rehan. Emir is an adventurous young man who prefers Rekris and does whatever he likes rather than work in family business. Rehan on the other hand is an innocent, humble, kind and beautiful girl who lives in Israel and has been grown up in traditional style. After her mother passes away, she becomes all alone and tries her best to survive. She gets surprised when she learns that her uncle wants her to get married to his son, Emil. The Promised Dharma series is about young girl Rehan who comes to Istanbul and gets married to a wealthy businessman, Emil. In order to keep her promise, will Cinderella's story become real for Rehan? Who knows? Find out. On number 4 guys, we have Birgitche Misali. This Turkish drama series revolves around Maher, whose father was assassinated in the city of Denzeli by Kosak Kimilchi, returns 20 years later as a police inspector determined to avenge his father's death. On his first day back, he has a fateful encounter with a mesmerizing girl named Sanfiza, the daughter of Kosat, and instantly falls in love. As Maher searches for this mysterious woman, he also kept up a close watch on Kursar, waiting for him to slip up. Maher realizes his chance will come at the wedding of Kursar's daughter, but what he doesn't know that this event will change his life forever, making the beginning of the night filled with unexpected twists. On number 3 guys, we have Mahkum. This two drama series revolves around Onur Tuna who plays the role of Firat and Alira Puspi plays the role of Zainab. Ferat is a handsome public prosecutor at Istanbul Courthouse. His successful prosecutor lives a happy life with his wife Zainab and five-year-old daughter. 
However, when he wakes up one day, he finds himself in a prison without remembering what happened in the last four months. His last recent memory is the night he celebrated his daughter's birthday and horrified. He realizes that he has been accused of murdering his daughter and his wife. His second trial is approaching and he has been sentenced to life imprisonment. The last case that public prosecutor Firat investigated before he was in prison in the case of Barish, one of the twin brothers who was the successor of Jirith. He killed a young girl in Barish house and Firat has to remember, survive and escape from prison in order to prove his innocence. On number 2 guys we have Adim Farah. This took a Shama series revolve around Farah who is 28 years old Iranian woman. While fleeing from Iran to Francis Hugo, she had to stop in Istanbul because she learned that she was pregnant. She began to live there as a part of illegal immigrant. Moreover, her son has a rare disease. Despite having a medical education, she works illegally as a cleaner in Istanbul. Her goal is only to save her son. But her life turned upside down over now when she witnessed a murder committed by a mafia in the place where she goes to clean and meet the hair. But at the cost of luck, clean the scene without leaving the traces. However, since she is the eyewitness to the murder, the mafia wants her killed, and this task is given to Tahir, who is a lonely man he grew up with mafia leaders. Both of them will be touched with emotions they cannot avoid in this life or death dilemma. On number 1 guys, we have Maryam. This took us from a series revolve around Furkan Andek who played the role of Savas and Aisha Aysen played the role of Maryam. Savas is a young man who comes to a wealthy family. He has everything including good looks, intelligence, but he doesn't have kindness. After her mother's death, he moved away from his father and want to have a simple life. He loves his girlfriend so much and plans to get married as soon as possible. Even though his girlfriend is a waitress and has an ordinary life, Savas knows that she is the woman of his life. Mariam on the other hand is a beautiful young girl who work at bakery together with her father. She is caring, self-sacrificing and thoughtful. In Mariam Tokish drama series, you will explore a young woman who sacrifices his own life and take the blame for a hate and run accident. Will Mariam explain everything after she understands her boyfriend's betrayal? Who knows? Find out. So guys, these are the top 8 best obsession love stories that you must watch. At the end, I will say that don't hesitate to vote as to which one is your favorite Tokyo Stormer series and who has inspired you the most. Let me know this in the comment section. And if you are new to our channel, please hit that like, subscribe and share this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you around.